This is code.org. Let's see what we're doing. Do this. We can turn a list of food into a food diary app. Ugh, I don't want to remember what, it, never mind. Uh, read the code. Use a pinned item to add a new item to the food diary list when the add item button is clicked. That sounds scary, it's not. Take a look at line 17. Can you figure out how join works? All right, one thing at a time. So we want to append food. Let's see what this does so far. Oatmeal, pancakes, crackers, peanuts. Okay, and what if I say a uh, burger? Yum, add item. Okay, it made a sound, but yeah. All right, let's see what's going on. Okay, so what we want to do is when we click this button, we want it to be added to the list. So we know how to add, right? We're going to do a pinned. Let's see. So the this is the add button. That makes sense. Oh, good. We have an event for it. On event that the add button is clicked. So when we click the add button, droop, drops in. The variable new food is going to be equal to get text diary input. Let's see. Yep, and that would be right. So it's going to grab the text out of this box and say, you are now, boom, new food. Well, where do we want to put new food? We want to add it to our food list. So I'm headed to variables, and I'm going to append. Okay. And what am I going to be appending? Oh, they wanted me to do that here. All right, fine. What am I going to be appending? Well, first, I need to save my food list. And I need to get rid of these quotes because it's not a string. It's a variable. I want to add whatever word was grabbed off of the, off the screen right there. Okay, let's try that. Boom. Ooh, does it keep going? Yeah, how about some unicorns? <laughs> All right, so what else was it? That's awesome. All right, take a look at line 17. Can you figure out how join works? All right. So line 17 is right here. Obvious. Well, mine's changed a bit because we added code, but this is what they're talking about, join. So what is join doing? Dairy output food dot join. Huh. Notice these quote, I mean, these uh, commas. What do you think it's doing? Join. So with our list, every time you spit out an item, every time it sets the text for food, it puts food out. It's putting a comma in between the list. And it stops at the end, so it doesn't put one hanging off at the end. That's kind of cool. Join it. will help you separate out text. Neat. All right. Let's uh, keep going.